guys it's michelle welcome to my channel grateful creation so glad you're here well <laughs> this poor canvas um i didn't realize i heard some chirping and i'm like what the heck is that and i had um a, one of my rags hanging out like it was hanging inside and outside of the um the water bucket i have here and it's that's what was dripping so it dripped all over here but i dried it out <laughs> so that's why it looks so crappy but we're gonna fix that because we're gonna do we're gonna do a transfer swipe with this um jody from painted dreamer did it the other day i'm gonna try it i noticed that you need to kind of like um prop it up a bit so i did that and i am testing out the new ppg pillow now <laughs> that's another thing i went to uh whoops that's the wrong one i went to home depot and i got this one which it doesn't say on here whether it's eggshell or anything like that so i had and it's it when i got it home it certainly was not tinted at all. It was not, um, it wasn't anything. It was just um, base paint, so. Because it was almost yellowish, you know? So I would stir it all up and I tried working with it and then I um, brought it back today and had it tinted. So enough about that, blah, 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 right? <laughs> Let's get moving. So I'm going to flood my, well, do I flood my canvas first? Yes. I'm going to flood my canvas with this lovely paint. And it does seem to work pretty well, guys. I will tell you that. So, all right, now I'm gonna put some in here and then we're gonna, we're gonna start going real quick. Um, as far as the colors, before I go there, this is a super custom color started out with s'mores and I just kept adding and adding to it because I forgot to order caramel drizzle on my last order and my last order has shipped already which yay I'm so happy and getting all the new ones so this is the caramel drizzle I might use it up um, it's not even close I think it, that has a little bit more red in it or something this is Amsterdam sky blue this is Liquitex soft pink this is TLP Blue Eyes. This is TLP, of course, in Pinwheel, my favorite. And this is titanium, un unbleached titanium from uh, Liquitex. And this is my darling Or. I love you. All right, so we are going to put some paint down here. Can you see? Yes, you can. Are you on? I think you're on. I notice you have to like kind of almost do that to it. Whoops. So I'm going to start. I did a couple test tiles with this brown color and on top of it, I'm no, I'm not. Yeah, I may as well. I'll just finish this all up. It's kind of sinking to the back there, but we'll fix that in a minute. Um, then I'm going to put the sky blue and you'll see what I do. Um, then I'm going to put the blue eyes over top of it because I want the blue next to the brown. I love that. Okay, then I'm going to put the unbleached titanium. Then the pink, I need, I did a couple test tiles and I need to put a little bit more pink than I was. So there we go. And then we have the pinwheel. And then we have the gold, which I love. Okay, so that's it for that. Now, it's probably way too much paint there, but we'll work with it. I might even, don't look. And then this stuff just got, it was shaken at the um, 
who are shaking because they just uh, put some, so I have to do that, sorry. So I am putting, this is a combination, this is Atelier Interactive in blue black and I put just a tiny bit of Prussian blue on it. And then I have um, Atelier Interactive in um, copper. So do we put copper down first and then blue? We might do two. I'm gonna put, yeah. And that's a copper. And then I'm going to roll this around. Now, when it comes to the, and I might use this for, um, just to scoop it up at any point in time, but I'm, I just figured I'd do it this way this time. So I'm kind of moving the paint around both sides. There's way too much paint on here. I don't even know if this is gonna work now. So I am going to and let it do its thing. Oh, Jesus, right over it pretty. I put way too much paint in here, guys. So I'm going to try and what I want to do is keep these beautiful cells that are happening here. And I did not get it up there. So I don't know how this is going to work. But what I want to do is start in the center to keep the cells because if you start at the outside and you've got these beautiful cells, they're just going to go off. So I'm going to get, get it close to the edge here. Well, that's kind of cool. There's still lots of paint in here. I might even try to swipe again. I'm gonna put that cell activator right in there too. Let's try that just for giggles. See, I've still got all this paint left. I just scraped that, my, my tool in here. So let's try, how about copper first this time? No. I still need to go dark because there's too many light colors. I need contrast, my dears. Contrast. Let's try it again, see if it works. If it doesn't, I'm not gonna put it down, that's all. So here we go. Oh, uh, I got a lot of white there. Letting it come up. Doesn't look bad though. I was kind of going for one of those POW shells or whatever kind of look. So um, it might work. Okay, once again, we're gonna put the cells in the center. really work too well. That's okay, we're gonna go with it. All right. Oh, look at all that big lusciousness, darn. All right, so I'm gonna spin this out. I'll show you the, um, oh, this is the, <laughs> practice tile, but that was before I put the Prussian blue in, that was just with the um, blue black. So I kind of like it. Oh, Jesus, geez Louise. I'm gonna stretch it out first before I spin it. Look how 
looks like I'm gonna lose those cells anyways. <laughs> Spinning it right to the edge or tilting it right to the edge. A lot of paint on there. And that is the paint that is the piggies and the not even a whole lot of base paint. I'm really liking what I see though. It's not, not going to be a lot of negative space. Doesn't look like. All right, let's move these guys out of the way before we have an accident. Whoa, Wilbur. Oh. Now, do I want to modify it before I spin? Nah, I think I'm going to spin. Do I have any bubbles I need to take care of? You know what, I'm gonna do it anyways. I don't recommend doing this. But when you have, yeah, there's still measles coming up. Um, I really wanted to test the paint out, so we'll see what happens. Yep, lots of paint. Ooh, pretty. The pink just gets swallowed up. I don't know what that is. That's so, oh, geez. I'm in my pajamas. <laughs> ah! Oh, geez. Stop, stop. gonna leave it. Wow. Or should I put another swipe over top of it? I could do that. What do you think guys? What should I do? Tell me now. <laughs> oh, let me get a toothpick out first. Do I need? Uh, yeah. When you, when you're at the the store, and usually you can get this paint, you know, pre mixed. It's already mixed. You just take it off the shelf and take it home. But this one had seriously, it was definitely a um, a base paint. Wow, kind of liking this. Maybe I should just leave it. I know if I put another swipe on it, I'm gonna regret it. There's no man parts on here, so that I'm good there. <laughs> yeah, guys, I think I'm gonna leave it. All right, I'll take you down for a close-up. Back in a flash. All right, guys, there we go, we're in frame. So, the pink showed up this time, yay. Yeah, I love this. So it's not uh, fancy schmancy with lots and lots of um, transfer swipes, but it looks like a shell. That's kind of what I was going for. See? Pretty. It has a lot of translucency. That's one thing I've noticed about this new paint. You get dimensional color, which is way cool. Thank you, Karen, for finding this. There's the light. Pinwheel. Yep. I like it. I might do a deconstructed bloom now. <laughs> I think I had to fix something there. There was something in it. So I might have to touch it up with a paintbrush. There are a few bubbles, but that's because it was just, I wanna say like four hours ago, and I put it into a smaller container. I don't quite know what's happening there. Maybe that's intentional, I don't know. But I like that blue-black mixed with the um, Prussian blue. 
just kind of liken it. It's, it's very shell, shellish. It's Miss Shellish. <laughs> Please be safe and create. Please like, share, and subscribe. Ciao for now.